Okay, so we're going to look at practice B. We're on chapter 6. Practice B, and we're going to do problem 12. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to write our given, and we're going to write our fine. Now, when you read the problem, you really need to chunk. Don't try and read the whole problem at once. Um, as you're reading something, write it down because there's going to be a lot of information you don't want to get lost. So it says a 40 kilogram projectile, so I'm going to call that MA, leaves a 2.00 times 10 to the 3 kilogram launcher, so I'm going to call that one MB. with a velocity of 8 meters per second. Now, if we conceptualize this, I have some type of a launcher and the projectile's in it. After it's launched, it's going to go this way. So that, the part that's confusing here is that's actually the A prime. The prime means after the launch. So remember, the equal sign is the event. I'm going to have something launched or something's going, you know, so whether like yesterday it was like a bullet in a block or something or things collide, the event is the equal sign. So this is after I have the projectile in the launcher, so that's actually after it's launched. So that's going to go one way, and then the launcher is going to go back a different way. Okay. So that's the hardest part of this problem. What is the recoil velocity of the launcher? So I want to find VB prime. Now what I didn't write down is VA is zero and VB is zero because initially the projectile's in the launcher and nothing's moving, right? They're both at rest. So when I write my basic equation, MAVA plus MBVB is equal to MAVA prime plus MBVB prime. And I want to solve for VB prime. I want to solve for the vo velocity of the launcher. Now I know from just conceptually thinking about it, the launcher is going to go opposite direction of the projectile. But we're going to work it out mathematically. So these are both zero. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to move this to the other side. So I'm going to say negative MAVA prime is equal to MBVB prime. But I want to solve for VB. So negative MAVA prime divided by MB is equal to VB prime. So now I'm going to substitute in my values. So negative 40 kilograms times 8 times 10 to the 2 meters per second divided by 2.00 times 10 to the 3 kilograms. So when I do it, VB prime comes out to be negative 16 meters per second. But remember, the negative sign tells me the direction, so it's just basically in the opposite direction because I don't know what the direction is. So whatever, so in this case, I just happen to call that positive, so this is going to be negative, or vice versa. If you wanted, you could have called this negative, but you should always start off whatever value you have, start off that as being positive. So the other one, if it's negative, it's just going in the opposite direction. And that's it. <laughs>